episode of Wheel Check. And today we're going to be looking at some Superstar SS01s and a pair of wheels that are quite interesting. These are the puppies. These are 14 by 7. And this is the pair that are in really good original condition. Nice, kind of like textured effect on the centers. And this would, this is, you can kind of see it in the light. It's a diamond cut star. It goes a bit like, like an oil and water effect, the rainbow. It's quite cool. Yeah, nice looking wheel. Always wanted a set of these. So I found another pair, and I've had them blasted now. And on the screen now should be what they looked like before they were blasted. So they're quite terrible condition, really. And this is where I'm at currently. I've taken all the old hardware out. I needed to use my rounded bolt remover tool because some of these nuts were absolutely beyond saving. They're rusted to hell. And the same thing goes for the nut seats. They were absolutely, look at the state of that. Dangerous, really. What you can see is the fact that these are the special gold series ones that used to have gold and dice lips. So that's a quite a nice little detail. You can kind of see it in places where they obviously blasted them and missed a few bits, but no biggie. But they're in they're in good condition other than the uh, nut seats. Also a nice blast and uh, sand and a polish up and then some paint black paint and I'm not going to go gold with that noise again just going to match these ones these ones have lost all of the uh, paint on the bolts and the hardware so probably just get them black anodized I'll be banging these uh, nutsy inserts out got a few out already but I'm just using a well basically a socket it's a rounded bolt remover tool it's pretty much similar size to fit in there and uh, just giving it a good old wallop with the hammer and they from behind outwards and they come out a couple of hits not too bad I have uh, soaked these for a couple of days in a uh, penetrant oil and that seems to have helped things they're coming out quite cleanly so the new ones should just bang straight in This is the other pair of wheels I was talking about, and they are Crimson Z Comps. Good looking wheel, quite a classic design, not too much like it. A couple of weird things about these wheels is, first of all, the bolt spacing. These are the only set of wheels I've seen that are like this, having the two close together, one on its own. Yeah, it's really strange. They're normally, you know, evenly spaced. Second thing is the lips. Right on the edge of the lip. It's not hard to show, but it actually turns in on it back on itself. Apparently quite a few uh, like centre lock racing wheels do this. Yeah. This is the first pair of wheels that I've had that did this. That's a good looking wheel. These are only 14 by 6s so they're real skinny little ones. But I saw them pop up in the auctions and had to have them. Quite an annoying thing, I don't know why they do this but the valves in different places, GWL, GWL and the valves. That was really annoying. <laughs> and I thought we'd show you guys this. This turned up a couple of weeks ago and it's an SSR Star 5. And they made a similar looking wheel called the F5, but the F5 had eight 
bolts around the edge, and this has only got six. So that's the way to tell that it's a Star 5. This is, this is in pretty good condition. Nice barrel. Maybe a little clean up, but doesn't look like it's seen much action. Yeah, quite cool. It's 5x114.3. Good looking wheel. Thank <laughs> you.